Honorable Brandon Michael, I would like to introduce at this point your lawyer for the prosecution, your ginger. Hello. And the lawyer for the defense, Carter. <laughs> oh, come on. I didn't uh, do it. It was the... Yeah, I know. Someone you. take that away. The person right. over there. Every single week we take that away, and every single week it appears again. It. Let's move on to the merits of this case. Now, obviously, we're reaching out, or we have someone reaching out to us. They have an issue. What we do is we solve it here on the Court of Madhouse. Sir, what seems to be your issue? Hey, man, I, I got this friend. He, uh, we've been friends forever, dude. He's like a childhood friend of mine. We grew up together. with school all our lives. He started talking to this girl a couple months ago. It's been probably like three months. I mean, I thought it was just a fling. They swiped right on Tinder. That's why I call it Tinderella and matched <laughs> up. It was perfect to go at the start, I guess. Now things, I guess, are getting a little serious. And he's talking about buying a ring. Whoa, and, guys, it's been three months. I don't know if I should, you know, be a good friend and step in and, and tell him I don't think he should do that or – if I should just keep my mouth shut and just let him screw his life up. So, I mean, I, I really don't know what, I, I don't know if I need to be a good friend and, and just shut up and just let it ride out or be a good friend and step up and, and tell him he needs to slow down. That's an easy one. I, I like how both of the selections were be a good friend. So, I mean, it, obviously, <laughs> it's very difficult. You want to be a good friend and step up, be a good friend and shut up. You just want to be a good friend, and that's uh. That's hard situation there. Uh, before we move on to your defense, I see you over there chomping at the bit. Prosecution, what you got? I say, obviously, they're good friends. They've been friends forever. <laughs> Talk to him. She hasn't even made her point yet. Oh, okay. Exactly. I'll Calm wait. down. I'll wait. As a hopeless romantic that I am, I believe that true love can happen wherever it happens. So at least talk to him. Let him know your thoughts, Order. your feelings. But like, I just want what's best for you. And if this means marrying her, then sure, go oh for it. But God. at least say your piece as the best friend. Let your voice be heard. Defense. <laughs> Oh, can you be a little more? Can you be a little you more? You are so evil. Wordy I, than that. Look, I had, uh, my best friend back home in college, uh, we lived together, and he had dated this girl, and uh, I knew the entire time she was absolutely horrible for him. So I told it him. It was like hate at first sight. Do you hate love? No. Do you hate true love? No. This you, sounds like it. You order, can just see, order, order. You can see some people, and you can tell that they uh, th this person is toxic. And as a friend, it's your job to tell them. All right, so uh, real quick, though, you're saying defense that uh, three months, way too soon. Uh, prosecution, you're saying it could be any time. It could be any It could time. literally be a few minutes after you meet. It, uh, Don't marry Tenderella. All right, sir. Uh, Calm down. Let's, let's, say, let's say that this, this goes a little bit further. If you were asked, and this is your friend, remember, would you be the best man in his wedding? Oh, uh, I mean, man, he's, he's been my best friend since we were kids. So, I mean, I would have to. But at the bachelor party, I will, you know, I'm going to try everything in my power to make sure this is what he wants to do since he's only been knowing this girl for three freaking months. But, I mean, I, I would be that friend to step up and do it if he wanted me to. Wow. I think it's pretty obvious what he was saying. <laughs> yeah, no, I know where he's sitting right there. Uh, opinions, 320-94-FM, 320-9436. I'll give you guys a couple of minutes to get your arguments together. Just call and say Ginger is wrong. You always Stop! say that.